Mika. Hey, hold on. What are you doing here? I should be asking you the same thing. Aren't you supposed to be working right now? <sighs> you caught me. I was at an impasse and looking for a new place to take a nap. <laughs> I'm sure I have enough people watching over me. Can you kindly stop with the obvious act? Watching you? What are you talking about? Okay, if you want to keep it up, if you want to take a nap, you should go back to your own room. Ah. Don't get your hands dirtier than you have to. If this goes on, thanks just won't be enough anymore. Whatever are you talking about? more powerful you don't just rely on raw strength anymore yes I feel true strength from you you can't know how happy that makes me feel Shinsai thank you for helping me with my training thank you difficult sometimes to protect the people that we love but if we let it break us that's the end so I have to try to be more like you so everyone can have hope I'm pretty certain there are many people who have been saved by you but it's not just you alone as long as you remain the way you are, we will be able to rely on you and we'll have hope. All right. Can we go once more? Uh. <laughs> I understand. I'll train you today for as long as you like. <laughs> right on! <laughs> Master Sima Zhao, an Imperial Edict has been issued calling for your death. How does that make you feel? I always anticipated it would happen eventually. Looks like they're finally starting to take me seriously. Zhang Hui, I want you to take Deng Ai and Wen Yang and reinforce the border defenses with Xu. I see. Zhang Wei's so predictable. There's no way he won't try and take advantage of this opportunity. You just make sure you keep yourself safe. UNG, Jia Chong, come with me to Luo Yang. As I suspected, Jian Wei has embarked upon a large scale military excursion. Deng Ai and the others are in place, so they should be able to handle him. We have things to do here. <laughs> I like that look on your face, Zhao. Master Jia Chong. Please don't. It's okay, Yuanji. The true goal of the Kingdom of Wei is to bring this war to an end. The Wei Emperor, Cao Mao, has lost sight of this. He's only thinking of himself, and that egotism is causing havoc within the Kingdom. If we leave things as they are, a return to war is inevitable. The sacrifices our predecessors have made will have been for nothing. It is my solemn duty to put an end to that element within our kingdom, which values only bloodlines above the greater good. 
Master Zhao. In order to end the war that plagues this land, I will slay Cao Mao with my own hand. <sighs> Don't come any closer, Sima Zhao. How dare you? Do you even know what it is that you were doing? I know. This is farewell, Your Majesty. <laughs> Fall back, you scoundrel! Keep your distance! Stop it! Stop! <laughs> Fall back, you scoundrel! Keep your distance! Stop it! Stop! It's a heavy burden. I know. But this isn't the end yet. You will be forced to bear even heavier burdens before this is over. Yeah. But if it's too much for you, you can always share the weight with me. I just need you to keep me in line, like you always do. Thank you, Yuanji. Will you stay by my side from now on as well? Th that's not fair. What am I supposed to say to a question like that? Zhang Hui, welcome back. How was the battle against Xu? We claimed a famous victory at Tao Yang. It's hardly surprising. After all, I was there. Xu's on the verge of ruin. I believe we could easily drive our forces as far as Chengdu right now. Yeah. Wei, Wu, Xu. Perhaps they're all relics of the past now. Zhang Hui, tell the men to make for Tian Shui. Understood. The Wei Emperor, Cao Mao, has been slain by Sima Zhao. This internal conflict provides us with our perfect opportunity to attack Wei. This will be the end of it all. The battle against the kingdom where I grew up. I have to give my all and fight so that I have no regrets. I feel like we're carrying the dreams of so many on our shoulders. Master Zhuge Liang, the young master. We must be the ones to build a land of virtue. Let's do this! The northern campaign my lord husband could never complete. It now falls to us to do it in his stead. When I first fought alongside my father and brothers, our enemy was the Wei army. We were defeated that day and lost so much. But we will not lose again. I do not believe Lord Liu Chan desires any more conflict. In which case, we must make this the final battle. We must achieve all that Father and Master Liu Bei dreamed of. Come, everyone! This land will bear witness to our final day of reckoning! I bring news! The Shu army approaches! They are almost upon us! I believe the Shu forces number significantly more than last time. It is remarkable how many men they have managed to muster, in spite of the defeats they have suffered. I don't think you should be particularly impressed by that. It just means they're using up the last of their military reserves. I'm prepared to declare with total confidence that there isn't a single soldier left in Shu not in this battle. That is an indication of how committed the enemy will be to this confrontation. If we lose here, the land will be returned to the chaos of war once more. For Master Sima Zhao, my spirit will burn with righteous anger! Yes, no matter how often the enemy insists on attacking, we must hold them out. That is our mission. All forces, prepare to engage!
Reports are coming in that the officers, the ones defending, have been killed. Can we possibly stand against such a strong foe by ourselves? Yes. If the enemy is using its mobility to confuse our larger force, we'll face them with smaller numbers and stronger fighters. Jean is huge. That's why at times it can get stuck in fighting the same way. There are some enemies that will not work against. This is one of those enemies. Oh, brother. That's why the people are calling you the reincarnation of the hero Zhao Yun. A hero? Many of those renowned heroes faced impossible odds, and they still managed to somehow seize a victory. Now, it's our turn to do the same. All right, everyone prepared to fight hard. And now we ride to victory! Ah! I can't believe the timing. Just a little bit more and we would have broken through Wade's lines. Ugh. I cannot believe we're being forced to give up this once-in-a-lifetime chance. But this emergency at Chengdu, what could have happened? I don't understand, but since it ordered the troops to return, it must be important. Regardless, let us hurry. Ah! We have prevented the Shu invasion once more. This could never have been achieved without the selfless dedication of all of you. You have my gratitude. I have no need for your gratitude. Besides, the Shu forces were simply too weak. Master Deng Ai, do you think we should just attack Chengdu ourselves right now? I agree with Master Zhang Hui's proposal. Shu must have used up every last soldier they had in this battle. If we are going to strike, now is surely the time. Hmm. Then, I will request an audience with Master Sima Zhao. I will make the proposal to attack Chengdu myself. We must prepare for battle at Tianjui. <laughs> 